Okay, you guys, so I know I have already made a video on TikTok on how to make the whipped coffee, but I don't have as much of a following on TikTok as I do on my YouTube. So I'm going to go ahead and make a video just so that everyone can kind of see just how I make this. And I've been making this literally every morning because it's that good. And yeah, I'm obsessed. So if you want to see just how to make the viral tiktok whipped coffee then go ahead and keep on watching so you will need sugar and whatever kind of milk you prefer i prefer oat milk um whatever kind of coffee creamer you prefer your favorite i use also the natural bliss oat milk creamer and then you will need instant coffee not just regular in a tub coffee grounds it has to say instant or this will not work and you will need your cup and whatever you use to mix or drink a straw or you don't have to have a straw um or a spoon and a whisk this is just to mix all the ingredients together or you can use a spoon honestly and then you will need a one tablespoon measure and just a bowl to mix everything together you can use any kind of bowl it doesn't matter i know some videos on tiktok are kind of confusing because they don't have actual directions on them so that is kind of why i'm also doing this today okay you guys so this is the part where we will be making the actual whipped coffee so you'll need your bowl sugar your instant coffee and a cup of hot water i use a cup just so i can kind of scoop out what i need because I didn't want it to get cold in the process and also um, for the end of making the drink you will need ice so I just have a cup of ice here and I'm actually gonna crack in some pink Himalayan salt I get this one from Trader Joe's um, the reason I'm gonna crack in some salt is because some recipes call for salt but um, I will be adding it just to keep the ice from melting. I really don't have a super precise way of measuring other than this. I kind of just go by how it's looking on how much water to add. And say there's too much water, I'll add a little bit more coffee and a little bit more sugar. So I'll show you all what I mean whenever I actually start mixing this all together. Okay, so I'm going to take this instant coffee. And I'm just going to get out a scoop. So I'm going to start off with a tablespoon and about a half a tablespoon. And then for the sugar, I'm only going to add a tablespoon for now. It is kind of a lot, but it's kind of okay too because my coffee creamer and my milk are actually unsweetened. So the sugar adds back in the sweetness because the coffee is very strong i'll tell you that if you drink with sweetened milk and sweetened creamer it probably won't be as strong but it goes on preference basically so now i'm gonna add in a tablespoon of the hot water that i had nearby i'm just gonna leave that in there and then what we're gonna do is just take the mixture and we're gonna start whisking it together it takes a good minute till it starts to get to that fluffy light brown texture it'll kind of look like peanut butter okay so this is about the texture that you want if you want it to be more heavy and more whipped you can go ahead and add more coffee and mix it in right here and also you can taste it and see if it's sweet enough and if it's not you can go ahead and add more sugar but um i've made it a few times now and this is about what i like it to look like so i'm gonna stir it around for a little bit more and then we are going to assemble the coffee okay so now we are gonna put all the ingredients together and this is how you make the actual coffee so first thing i'm going to do is take the milk of choice and like i said i'll be using oat milk i'm just going to add a good amount about there i use a little bit more milk than cream and now we add the creamer about halfway and now i'm going to take my ice okay Perfect. Now the fun part, we're gonna take the mixture you made in the bowl. 
make sure you scrape all of it. If you really want a coffee flavor, you know. But um, like I said, it's all about preference. If you decide you want it sweeter, add more creamer once we've kind of mixed everything together. It's just all about how you make it. Now we're gonna add the coffee mixture in. Just try to get all of that in. Now that it's all made, you can just go ahead and mix it in. So that is it for the whipped coffee guys, that is literally how you make it, it is super easy and as easy as it is, it tastes so amazing. This usually takes me like 5 minutes tops, maybe 6. I guess it depends what all you decide to add into it. The more simple you keep it, the easier and quicker it is to make and it tastes so good. So yeah, just remember you can use whatever milk and whatever creamer you decide and just make sure that the coffee is instant. And that's it. I hope y'all enjoyed this video and I hope to see y'all in my next one. Bye guys.